Basically, we're going to be left homeless, yeah, no place to go. Two weeks ago, Medford resident George Mishlakian was served an eviction notice from his apartment at 1510 West Main. Not for anything he did, but for what building safety inspectors say the apartment could be doing to him and his health. It's just not safe. The air is not safe. Mishlakian received these documents from the city of Medford, a notice of substandard housing saying the place has been condemned. It's nuts. It's awful of mold. You can look in my closet on the floor and see human feces up against the wall because, because the toilet broke underneath the house. 15 violations in all, from rotting walls to hazardous electrical wiring and plumbing, even stagnant sewer water beneath the floors. The owners, they didn't put no money into the place. The place is falling apart. To me, it seems like they're like a slumlord. The residents tell me the landlords, who are based out of Ashland, are often out of the country. I've tried to get it fixed many times. They haven't because they've been in Burma. David Douglas has lived at this apartment complex for the last four years. He says Camelot Court is no Camelot. You can go inside my house like now and look at the walls, just growing mold up in the door of things. And David's roommate, Sadie, says the conditions have been so bad, the apartment has been making her sick. I can't breathe as good as normal, you know. I just, I'm constantly uh, being sick and, and gasping for air. But on a fixed income, these residents say they have limited options. And now one less option, thanks to the city. They came in here two weeks ago with masks on, and, and they said everybody's got to go. I'm angry. Because I feel like I've been taking, everyone here has been taking advantage.